Alright, so here we go. Back to uh, Brunson's lab. Yes. Back to Brunson's lab. Doc. Dr. Brunson's lab. Bryson. Or is it Bryson? Hmm. Don't care. Well, the daughter is already here, probably. Hello? Anne? Are you here? Anne? Oh, Commander. Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. Of course. Are you all right? Yes. No. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else. I don't remember what. And I took it out on him. So stupid. It's all right. I can come back. No, please. I'm okay. Seeing all this again. He was so obsessed. Yep. Crazy sometimes. Yep. I didn't get a chance to know him. Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man. A pioneer. But... He could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still I am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I loved that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. Well, I'll get used to it. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne, you sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father, taught me to never be afraid of the dark. Good man, Elias. Good man. <laughs> so what do we do now? I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, and we all had regular psyche valves. But now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway, aren't I? Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. What? I don't get it. You studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now it might actually help us understand Leviathan. Really? In what way? We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the Queen uses pheromones to give orders. Yes? At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. What? What Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. It uses the artifact to establish a connection, and then it controls the mind of anyone near it. Hey, loco. Need a hand? What brings you down here, James? Heard you're closing in on the Reaper killer. 
Anything that can scare those bastards has to be worth a look. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping. We didn't detect any energy emissions from the artifact. But the Reapers were able to use the artifact to trace Leviathan somehow. My theory is that most of the time, the artifact simply acts as a receiver. We'll only be able to trace Leviathan through it when it actively takes control of someone. As it did on the asteroid. Right. Unless it needs something, Leviathan doesn't bother communicating. I guess it and my father had something in common. You said Leviathan's control was similar to a quantum entanglement communicator, which is untraceable. Yes, but this isn't a natural QEC. Leviathan has to send a pulse through the artifact to alter your mind and create the quasi-QEC effect. What? And that can be traced. Right. Just like Anne, I know this is hard, but if there's anything more you can tell us... I don't think there's anything more I can tell you. But maybe I can show you. What are you saying? The artifact only sends out a signal when Leviathan's controlling someone. So let it control me. You could trace the signal. You mean let it take you over? That's too dangerous. It's my call, not yours. You said I'm your last chance to find this thing. We have no idea what will happen. If we wait, the Reapers will get to Leviathan first. I'm the only one here who's spent enough time with it to do this. You're looking for something to fight the Reapers, Commander. I'm looking for the monster that murdered my father. We still don't know what we're looking for. Then let's find out. Commander, this thing we're doing with Anne sounds dangerous as hell. Noted. Edie? Energy signature locked in. Waiting for activation. You sure about this? Yes. I'm sure. Guns ready! Right here. Okay. I'm ready. James. Drop the containment shield. Shield is dropped. Artifact online. Anything? Nothing yet. Wait. There's something. I feel a chill. Edie? No trace yet. Holy hell! Signal is tracking. Maintain connection. Turn back. The darkness can't be breached. Yo! Maintain connection. Listen to me. I found you. And the Reapers are right behind me. You have brought them. You are a threat. So are you. I've seen what you can do. The war needs you. There's no war. There's only the harvest. Edie, do we have enough? Partial lock. Maintain connection to narrow the search. You heard her. We got enough. I'm hitting the shield. Do it. Man. Anne. Anne, are you all right? Yes. I think so. Did we get anything? Yes. But it will take some time to search. Coordinates sent to the Normandy. Good. It's a start. Commander, I sense something else. Anger. It knows we're getting close. I think it wants to kill you. Come on. Let's get you some help. A much needed rest, yes. Okay, so we'll be ending this episode here. Um, let's see, we're just gonna go back to the Normandy, and that's it. Return to Normandy, and we're gonna end this episode. There we go. So, oh wait, let's just check out, damn it. Let's just check out the galaxy map still, got time. Okay, so this is what we gotta search. Okay. Sigurd cluster, anywhere else? That's it? Great, perfect. Okay guys, we'll be seeing you in the next part of this fantastic episode. Mass Effect 3. Bye-bye.